I'm going to be doing a Miley Cyrus inspired makeup and outfit. This is a really punk outfit and I even broke out my combat boots for this outfit so I'm super excited about this and my makeup is pretty dramatic. She wears a lot of eyeliner and so yeah, I think this look is also really good for fall and I didn't really do anything with my hair. She usually just has it kind of messy or up in like a sumo wrestler bun thing. So yeah, I'm so excited to show you guys and I don't know if you guys noticed but I got a new camera and it's a Canon T3i and it's amazing. We got new lighting. I feel like a professional here. So Sabrina's filming me, so thank you so much for filming me, sissy. And without further ado, let's go on with this video. We're first going to be applying our Murad Skin Perfecting Primer so we can rock on all day and our makeup will stay off. This primer is amazing since it has salicylic acid in it and it really helps with your problems or at least my problems. <laughs> Now I am dabbling on my concealer and as you guys can see I kind of need a lot of this. And then I'm going to be blending it out using my Sedona Lace Foundation Brush. I love this brush because it's so dense. Alrighty! That was weird. Now we're going to be moving on to another of my favorite products and yes it is covered by little sparkly leaves because I love fall. Who doesn't love fall? I mean there's pumpkin in front of me. So we're just going to be blending this into our skin and using our fingers. Look! There's that pumpkin again. I don't know what to name him you guys. Do you have a name for him? Now I'm going to be using the NYX HD eyeshadow base and applying this all over my eyelid. Uh huh. You do that girl. Okay, so now I am using a base. I am using the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Yogurt. And there's that pumpkin again. I mean, seriously, pumpkin? Stop the videos on how to be a pumpkin. Jeez. So I'm just going to be applying this all over my eyelid. So now we're going to be applying Half Baked all over our eyelid. And don't mind my facial expression. I obviously have to concentrate a lot when I'm putting on makeup. Okay, so now we are going to be applying a darker brown color in the crease. And again, there's that facial expression. Someone should really tell me that I look very weird while putting on makeup. <clears throat> Sabrina. Okay, so now I am blending my eyeshadow. And this is just going to make sure that you don't have a very weird line just coming from your crease. Now I'm lining my upper lash line up with a very, very thin line and I'm using the NYX Super Skinny Black Eye Marker. Now I am tight lining my eyes and also lining my waterline with a black eyeliner pencil. And this is just going to give you a more dramatic look, just like Miley's. There goes that pumpkin again. Now we're going to be curling our eyelashes with the NYC eyelash color to prep them for mascara. Now I am using my show off mascara to show off my eyelashes. And I like to blink on my mascara as you guys can see and this really helps make your eyelashes a lot longer. Okay, so now we're going to be filling in our eyebrows with our Ofra Brow Liner. And every time I say that, I want to say Oprah. And then we're going to be combing them out with our Ardell Spoolie Brush. Now we are going to be applying the NYX HD Studio Grinding Blush in English Rose. And this is one of the coolest blushes ever. We're just going to apply this onto the apples of our cheeks and blend it out. Now I'm using my Ramel Airy Fairy Lipstick because Miley really loves her pink nude lips. The very final touch for this look is to add some lip gloss. I'm using the Stila Apricot Lip Gloss. So 
this is the finished makeup look and now let's move on to Miley Cyrus's punk bohemian outfits. I'm really excited because for this outfit we are doing our own DIY top and you just want to cut along the edges like I just showed you guys. And this is a really cute punk rock type shirt. I'm cutting along the sleeves. So you want to make sure that it is a little bit a little bit too big on the sleeve so that kind of has that bandeau showing style. And you also want to cut the neckline so that it doesn't choke you. <laughs> and that's it. It's really quick and easy. Just want to stretch it out to make it a little bit more slouchy and comfortable and you're done. I am just wearing a white tank top underneath since I don't have a bandeau top. And I just slipped on this top over it and this is how it looks. I absolutely love this shirt. It's very punk rock. The minute I saw it, I really thought of Miley Cyrus wearing this. I love that it has a black kind of slitted t-shirt right over the white portion of the shirt. And then I'm just wearing these distressed shorts. And my favorite part of this outfit is my combat boots. I got these from Marshalls and they are amazing. I love the buckles and every single detail on them. I noticed that Miley loves wearing hoop earrings, so that's exactly what I paired with this outfit. I'm also wearing a simple bracelet, although I believe that Miley would probably like to stack her bracelets. I just wanted to keep it simple since this shirt has already so much detail going on. Okay, so that is it. This is the makeup look and the outfit. I'm super excited for this look and I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. And if you like the new setup, the new lighting, everything, please thumbs up this video. It'll mean a lot to me and Sabrina, of course, for filming this. And she spent so much time filming this, so thank you. And so, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll talk to you guys very soon. Bye, guys! What are you doing there? <laughs> God, these brushes taste bad. <laughs> Sorry. Smile and go to Disneyland. Oh, and I think this is so Miley Cyrus. Sabrina's still me, so. Oh, ask me. You could be like, you just finished your makeup. What do you want to do? I'm going to Disneyland. Are you filming? Yeah.